Zapdos is not gonna defeat me, Mr. Lieutenant Surge. Voltorb gun? What the crud is that? Hello, hunters. Just sheep killer here, and welcome back to Pokemon Adventures Red Chapter. Last time, we dealt with some weird side quests, and we also made our way into Saffron City, where we're fighting against Team Rocket, who have taken over Stealth Co. Green is dealing with Sabrina, Blue is dealing with Koga, and I am dealing with Lieutenant Surge. Now I gotta take down one of these Voltorbs to get rid of this electric barrier, so let's do that. I choose the left one. Was that the one? No. Oh, what? I can battle it again! I don't want to battle it again! Are you the one that's controlling this electric barrier, Mr. Voltorb? That was the one! The gate is gone. I, I don't get it. I got rid of the Voltorb that was generating the electricity. So why? Why is the electricity still on? Yeah, <laughs> do you really want to know? Do you want to know why there are endless so there's an endless source of power? Do you really want to know? I'm guessing it's Zapdos. I'm guessing right now, it's Zapdos. Well, take a look! I was right! It's Zapdos! This can't be happening! Do you remember Red? I caught Zapdos at the abandoned power plant. Thanks to Zapdos, I will have endless source of free energy! The legends were true after all. Ha 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 ha! Now boy, ask me whether I still want to go back to being a gym leader. Ha 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 ha! Zapdos, I command you to use your full power! Wait, what? Ha 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 ha! You may have got infinite energy, but your fuse still couldn't handle all that energy at once. How could I forget that? Pfft, no big deal. I'll handle you myself. Now we got a battle to do, but let me catch this item first. TM29 Psychic! Finally got it right there. I'm just gonna have Sal up front. It should be good. Zapdos is not gonna defeat me, Mr. Lieutenant Surge. Voltorb Gun? What the crud is that? And he used Explosion! Is that gonna kill me? Sal, what the heck? You died by a Voltorb gun! I guess Sal was tonight's big loser. We got Aerodactyl though, against Zapdos? It's only level 40, Moltres is level 50! Why are you spamming Detect? You try to use it again? Aerodactyl will destroy you. Now your speed's lowered. What are you gonna do? You're gonna do nothing, that's right. And Pluck, why aren't you attacking me the right way? There's a full restore. Not that it matters. Okay, catch a Rock Tomb. And one more attack will do it. They're not using electric moves, why aren't they? Did they burn up all their electricity from what Lieutenant Surge said or something? Probably. Now comes Electrode. Electrode doesn't use electric moves, I can stay in. Actually, it's using an electric move for once, and it almost killed me. But we should still one-shot it, it's Electrode. Not... Not, like, Shuckle or something. But there we go. And out comes Electabuzz. I don't really want to stay in on Electabuzz. I guess I can... I can use a Max Revive on Sal, and then just let Aerodactyl die. Why not? There we go. Aerodactyl's gonna die. There's the Electro Web. Aerodactyl's dead. Well, we got Sal to deal with Electabuzz now. There's the Electro Web again. I was already slower than you. Don't know what you're doing. Will Sal one-shot this thing? Yes, it will. Sal is a beast, not against Voltorb. There's another Voltorb gun, it's Sal's one weakness. There's the explosion again, Sal is dead. Right? Yep, yeah, Sal was freaking dead. He couldn't survive that. A stubborn boy like you needs a more decisive blow. Zapdos, maximum energy! Rock! Wait, get off my shoulder, you stupid. Ah! It's not. Oh. This is the gym leader. Uh-huh, got it! We got the Thunder Badge! This is how we're getting the badges, isn't it? My gloves are all burnt, might as well take this. Lieutenant Gloves. Remember, no matter how many Pokemon you've got, or how powerful they are, nothing's more powerful than real friendship between a Pokemon trainer and their Pokemon. Yep, Lieutenant Surge and Zapdos didn't have a bond at all, so Zapdos didn't really listen to him properly. You're a good fighter, alright. But then, I guess fighting is all you care about, j judging by your rough skin. Your scrawny body isn't healthy like mine. Grr, cheap shots. Kadabra, cut her in half. What? Pokeballs on her chest. Colfair, you screech! Jillypuff, you sing! Grr, these hideous sound waves. Ah, it's giving me a headache! Wow, that's how Green defeated Sabrina. Well, now that I'm here, might as well take her badge. How do I get out of here? Tiki, time to go. Lieutenant Surge got knocked out by his own Zapdos. So I guess we move on. Let's just move on here. Oh, Blue's still battling Articuno. Red! Doesn't make sense. This guy's controlling Articuno way too easily. So you finally noticed, didn't you? You must seem to have forgotten that these trainer 
badges are more than just souvenirs from gym battles. Each badge contains a special power that heightens the Pokémon power, empowering the badge holder to control any Pokémon. This Articuno happens to be under the power of the four badges held by the Team Rocket Triad and our exalted leader. Wahahaha! <laughs> yep, they have the badges from Lieutenant Surge, Koga, Sabrina, and Giovanni. We can make any Pokémon jump to our every whim. That is why we threw away our status as gym leaders. This is power! Now that I got both of you right where I want- Now I got both of you right where I wanted. Check the Articuno. Full power! Freeze the entire room! Charizard! Come out, Pidgeot! Porygon! What? Hurry, Articuno! Freeze them all! Strike Koga now! He escaped! So did Articuno. Return! Well, they are well, he is a ninja. He got the soul badge. Red, take this badge. Remember what Koga said? Use it. Let's meet again soon. So, did he get his own, or did he give me the only one? Don't really know, but we got a soul badge now. Suddenly got two badges today. Now we only have Sabrina's badge and the Earth badge left. I assume, I'm assuming we'll get both of those during this Team Rocket thing we're doing. Because they also have badges. We don't have Sabrina's or Giovanni's, but we'll probably be getting them in this whole mission here. Kanga- what? Kangas 2? Is that supposed to be the evolved form of Kangas Kid? Like a male Kangaskhan? What the heck? So here we go. Roshan is going to evolve into Espeon. Heck yeah. Espeon, we have we have Espeon now. Oh, they're learning Psychic naturally. What the heck? I let you evolve because you got the TM, but then you go and learn Psychic on your own. I really want to keep Flamethrower because I don't have any Fire types, so we'll get rid of Thunderbolt. I better avoid him. Oh, that's the other entrance. Okay, and yeah, he's the one who's mad at me for tricking him. That's why Red was saying he better avoid him. Yeah, I get it. And there's a cage blocking the door. Is that where green is? It might be where green is. Let's be red. Team Rocket's target! That's right. Now I'm gonna go through the teleporter by you once I'm done. Hey, you have Sal! What are you doing with Sal in your party? Don't earthquake me. I, I doubt you'll have earthquake. You just go to sleep. Okay, you're no threat. So over here. That looks like it might be the way to go. Let's take the other teleporter and see where it takes us. Yep, this isn't the way to go. Well, we got Team 36 left. I already had that, didn't I? Didn't I already have that? Well, no, I didn't. But no one can learn it. Oh, King can, though. Maybe King will finally have a good move. We got another heal point. Heck yeah. Heal point and sludge bomb for King if we ever bring them back to the team. Did I come down from a staircase? I don't think so. Let's go up. Yeah, we definitely come down from the staircase. Yeah, I know this is what I saw earlier. It's just a chance to be out. I remember you. You're that toy that tried to stop us from catching Articuno. Oh, you failed because we ended up catching Articuno. You're right about that. You're the kid from Seafoam Island! Ha 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 So you're the famous Red that Lieutenant Surge and Koga warned us about? Ha 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 I assume you came here for the key. Well, you're not going to get it that easily. So they're the ones who give us the key, okay. And, oh, they got five Pokémon. Sal and Poliswag. Poliswag is hurt. Toxic? Why would you talk to the one on low HP? Oh yeah, Sal. Count Sal has immunity. So that can't really happen. You can't explode because they got poly swag. This is perfect. This is a perfect duo. They can't explode, they can't poison. Let's just body slam the wheezing. And then what can I do with Arbok? I guess water pulse the best we've got. It's not gonna kill it. Oh, once we get a critical. Heck yeah, poly swag. Now body slam the guy. There we go. That's another way to one-shot wheezings. And Meowth. What's Meowth gonna do? Oh, I have the perfect plan. We're gonna earthquake. Switch to Aerodactyl or Gary 2? We'll switch to Aerodactyl. I have two flying types now. So, I can just completely avoid damage from Earthquake. And succeed in one-shotting them both. Sal is amazing. And it's only for one getting experience now. How did they get themselves an Arcanine? Aerodactyl, you couldn't, you couldn't one-shot him. Oh well, we got Sal to finish the job. There we go. That kid. Hmm. What about us? Grr. I can see why Koga and Lieutenant Surge have such difficulty fighting you. As a promise, take the key and go. You're helping us win. What? Ha 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 It's hilarious, that's all. We once encountered a kid who looks just like you. Let's just say he's in the hospital right now. There's no music now. Who are you? Oh, you're that kid from Seafoam Island. I'm poisoned! Polyswag's dead. 
Gosh dang it. Well, we got the other warp right around somewhere. It is over here. The warp's right here. Here we go. We got the key, and it didn't break that time. Oh, we got beds. Oh, yeah. There's a healing point here. Forgot. Let's take that heal point. And now we're fully healed again. Heck yeah. And we got a trainer. This is your last step. No, it's not. I got plenty of steps left, you crud butts. Just because, I'm gonna go back and heal again. I didn't mean to step into that teleporter. Gosh dang it. Let's just heal. Can I heal? There we go. Probably when you play Pokemon on a keyboard, you can't control it all right all the time. And two doors. Oh. Oh, they're not doors. They're pathways. And what's this? A plate device. Whoa, pretty heavy, that's for sure. Huh? It's Sabrina! What's she doing? Is she looking for me? It's, it's Sabrina! She was the one who attacked the research lab back at Palatown. Why is she here? Is she looking for this? These annotations on the device resemble the gym badges. Are these where the badges supposed to fit in? Right now I have six of the badges in my possession. I need one more to fill up all seven slots. Who's there? Ah! Might as well reveal ourselves. She spotted us. Well, the best defense is a good offense. Oh, ho you found the device I see. Something wrong, Red? Oh, come on. Surely you knew that I'm a master of disguise. G green Ooh, you finally figured it out. Tee-hee. Hurry, Red. Take a gander at this. It's the Marsh Badge. I copped it off at Psychic Chick Sabrina. G give me that, Green. Give it to you for free. Oh, please. You know me better than that. However, I will agree on a trade. The Marsh Badge for your Moonstone. What Moonstone? Don't play coy, Red. I've got to have that stone, in case I ever meet up with that Sabrina chick again. Come on, Green, and we don't have to haggle like this if we combine forces and fight together. Wise up, Red. We came here for different for different agendas. But this trade will help both our causes. Just trust me and do as I say. You can trust me. What have I, what have I ever lied to you? When? And why not? Okay. The Moonstone that we got back in Mount Moon, we handed that to her. And now we got seven badges. Hey, Red, in all fairness, I should tell you something, Red. That device is their secret weapon. When all seven badges are inserted into the seven slots, it generates an energy that amplifies the Pokemon power big time. So that's it. Thanks. Actually, the real truth is that it creates a new Pokemon. The only reason why I was collecting the badges and sneaking into the building is to get my hands on that Pokemon. All the more reason to kill you, as if I needed any more reason. There's the real Sabrina. You little brats, you've made a fool of me long enough. There she is, the real one! Hand over that device now. Green, this is dangerous, stay back. Tee okay. You want the device, huh? I'll give it to you. All badges inserted, here we go! Green, what's going on? Hand that over. She took the plate device. Tee sorry, Red. Reveal the real Cascade badge and Boulder badge. Wha, wha, what? You thought the badges that I've returned back at Celadon City were real? Like I said, Red, you know me better than that. Tee so we never got the real badges back before. But now we do have them back, I think. Hmm. They are fighting amongst each other. What amateurs. Sing him, come forth. Moltres. Singed him. Singed him, come forth. Not singed him. Just a typo throwing me off. Shock him, Zapdos. Freeze him, Articuno. Articuno. We actually got seven badges now. Gosh dang. We're gonna get the eighth one from Giovanni, I'm sure. Moltres. Are we gonna have to battle all three of them? It's time for Aerodactyl to get his revenge. Let's go. Heck yeah. Aerodactyl's gonna get his revenge. You leveled down. What the heck, Moltres? Aerodactyl gets a sweet revenge, though, after getting humiliated against Moltres before. Took him down. What? You defeated Moltres? Now, Articuno, we gotta battle you next. Aerodactyl should also be able to take this down easily. This should be a nice one-shot. There we go. Aerodactyl is a beast. I don't really want to remove them from the team at all. What? You defeated Articuno? Now it's Zapdos. The hardest one because we can't we can't hit them with the four times effective move. But let's use Roshan. And I got Ice Beam for you. Doesn't one-shot. I probably would have if I was still a Glaceon, but... Oh well. Just Shadow Ball. There we go. Zapdos goes down. And Roshan levels up. Yes! We did it! We took down all three birds! Once you defeated Zapdos! Yeah, now it's my turn. Now it's your turn. You defeated Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres! There's Green. What's she doing? Okay then. 
Get rid of these fakes and insert the real Cascade Badge of Boulder Badge. Now all seven badges are together. It's working! At last the new Pokemon is... Eek! No, it's flying away! What's it doing? What the? Finally, it's here. Destroy him! Fire Spin, Thunder, and Blizzard! Why not Fire Blast? That thing just fused the three birds! What the crud, dude? Hoo 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 this is Team Rocket's greatest scientific achievement! A simultaneous strike with the power of three Pokémon at once. We have experimented on several Pokémon towards the same end. Your Eevee, for instance, was a result from our experiment. Grr, you monster! It's the fate of all lab creatures. Where's my Pokémon? Eek! Green! Ha 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 ha! Zamolkno's powers! Oh, how I've wanted this power. Volcano, Boulder, Marsh, Thunder, Rainbow, Cascade, and the Soul Badge! The powers of all gym leaders. We've known for a long time that we needed all the badges to combine Pokemon's powers. However, taking badges from gym leaders were no easy task. Several times we tried force, but to no avail. Until one day, we've decided to wait. Wait for you and your friend Blue to collect them for us. We could have destroyed you both easily, but you both still had a job to do for us. So was that why she tried to attack Erica earlier? To try to get her badge? Probably. Let me thank you for your contribution. Goodbye! And they blow us off. First we'll take over your beloved Pallet Town. We will then use its unspoiled land and its people with their strange empathy for Pokemon. At last the place will finally serve a useful purpose. Gah, forget that. It's out town and we're not letting you mess it up. It's our town, what we meant to say. That's Toner Red. We're going to fight. There's Blue. He flew up here with Charizard. Charizard, return! I have rescued the hostages and my grandfather. All that's left is to defeat this person. What impertinence! Zamokuno, attack! Ah! Ugh. You're a charming couple of boys. I'm sure both of you would have been two very handsome men. Possibly even more charismatic than Giovanni. Perhaps. Well, I guess we'll never know now. Zamokuno, finish them! Hoo hoo hoo, no one can survive that blast. Huh? What? We've got some attacks of our own. Green! Who? Red! I'm not planning to die here. If we want to win, you will need to evolve your Ivysaur. Ivysaur evolves level 40. Did it tell me I need Venusaur? Well, how am I gonna get Venusaur? Oh. I, I need to have Venusaur in my party to finish this, okay. I've wasted many Pokemon on me. I should only carry four Pokemon. What do you keep making me go back for? Well, that's why they have this PC. Now I gotta drop two more members? Now, can we finally continue with the plot? Yeah, here we go. We're gonna take my Charizard. You, you can borrow my Blastoise for a while, too. Remember, the key word is borrow. Evolve! And our v we have our Venusaur now. Oh, that's why we needed to have two empty slots for Charizard and Blastoise. That's pretty cool. And we're battling Zap Molkano. What would this thing's typing be, though? I'll just try to talk to Pixie. We got frozen? Are you kidding me? Oh, we defrosted. Awesome. Oh, what's it doing? It's trying to use Sky Attack. It's glowing. Oh, well, we got the Toxic Leaf Seed combo going. Oh, wow. That restored a lot. They must have a crud ton of HP then. They're about to hit me with Sky Attack, though. I don't like that. Let's go in the Blastoise. Blastoise has some pretty good defense. Guess we're actually using you after all. It even one shot Blastoise. What the heck? What am I gonna do? Um, I guess we'll bring in Charizard. What can Charizard do? Flame Burst. Here he uses potions. That didn't heal crud. That also didn't do crud. Come on, Charizard. That poison's doing a lot of damage now, though. Full Restore, you just ruined my whole process. Get out of here. Let's try to Fire Fang. You're using Sky Attack again. That's gonna kill Charizard for sure. I can't burn you, I don't think. I don't even know what your typing is, but I don't think I can burn you. I probably should have used Scary Face to make King faster. Oh well, I just got a Toxic again, and that should be good. Okay, we got that combo going back again. I'm trying to use Tri Attack again. You paralyzed me? Come on. Okay, let's. You're using another full restore. Come on now. Get poisoned by my Sludge Bomb. I dare you. There they go. King is dead. Gosh dang it, they had to use Sky Attack at the perfect timing. Oh, well, I guess Roshan gets to, gets to steal the experience. Gosh dang it, Roshan. Yep, they stole all that experience. Impossible! There we 
go. They they separated. Giovanni. They've been freed. Moltres, Zepdos, and Articuno too. My Charizard, thank you. Oh, we gotta give it back. I believe you still have my Blastoise. We'll see if we give back Gary too. That's not Blastoise. That's what that's just what happens, okay? Yes, the building's coming down. Move it, Red. Return! 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 We gotta run, huh? Hurry, Red! We're just leaving Sabrina behind. There's Giovanni. I'm glad everyone is safe and sound. No one has slipped through our barricade. However, the three gym leaders and their boss are now nowhere to be found. But we rescued all the Pokemon they were using. With the proper training, they'll all grow into wonderful Pokemon. Huh? Where's Green? There she is. <laughs> Never in a million years did I think Team Rocket's new Pokemon was a monstrous bird like that. Sheesh. So much for my big plans. Anyways. Why the heck is he here? Red, I look forward to meeting you at the Indigo Plateau. Blue. Huh? My phone is ringing. Hello? Red, this is Bill! There's a monster in Cerulean City! The monster of Cerulean City? Monster's right! Ain't nothing but devastating out yonder! The northwest sector of Cerulean City's been barbecued! Are you sure it's a Pokemon? Ain't sure or nothing. Whatever it was, it deep fried the northwest sector of Cerulean City. It slipped in the Cerulean Cave, and it's mostly likely hiding, hiding there now. Red, just cause you scored a win against Team Rocket, don't go getting up but even trying to catch that thing. You hear me? <laughs> Hello? Red? Are you still there? Okay, Bill, gotta go. I'm gonna catch that Pokemon. Now can I get this ruling cave? Is that the side quest I already did? What were we supposed to do that after? Gosh dang it. Now what are we gonna do? That was a short surf. Yeah. Oh! What, what are you doing there, old man? What happens if I talk to you? Princess, you had us all worried. I thought your mother and I told you not to enter the forest. It's dangerous. Strange things have been happening there. Do you know how worried you're- What? This is a glitched out thing. Excuse me, but what do you mean by strange things? Lately, never before seen Pokemon started randomly appearing in Viridian Forest. Excuse me, but who are you? My name's Red. I'm from Pallet Town. I'm heading to the Indigo Plateau while looking for trainers to fight along the way. That's quite a dream, Red. I wish I could help you, but this town doesn't have any trainers strong enough to face you. What about the gym? The gym's been abandoned for quite some time now. The gym leader is no- is this supposed to be in Viridian City? We got HMO6, we got Rock Smash. That was supposed to be in Viridian City. I think that was some kind of glitch thing. We were supposed to do that over in Viridian City here, but we somehow triggered it over in Cerulean. That was weird. That was a weird thing and a half. There's this. What can I do with Jigglypuff now? I remember you. You're the Jigglypuff that I accidentally got out back in Pallet Town. I never, I never caught you. Why are you holding a small microphone? And it's trying to sing. We gotta battle it. Shiny Jigglypuff? Is it supposed to be shiny? There we go, we caught Jigglypuff. Yeah, was that supposed to be shiny or not? I, I have no clue. I got to go back and check that or something. Okay, so the Jigglypuff actually was supposed to be shiny because in the anime, Jigglypuff had green eyes and that's... and only shiny Jigglypuff has green eyes in the game, so... that's why that is the way it is. So it wasn't by random chance, that's supposed to happen. Alright, so I just realized we've been recording for quite some time, so I'm gonna end it here. I figured out what we need to do, and we'll be doing that next time. I'll see you guys then. Thank you guys for watching, and happy hunting! <laughs>